about you. My bro Pat's over for the weekend. Let's get through our morning routine, okay? Hey. I let him outside, then as I came down, I was about to go read my books. I said, you know what? I'm gonna record a day in the lifestyle vlog. You love that grass though, don't you? And here we have Ginger. Hey Ginger, what's up girl? See that sunspot? It's called my name, baby. This is what I do every morning. And don't, oh my gosh, dude. I don't even know what's happening here, bro. But this is what I try to do every morning. You know, it's, it's good to get in the habit of doing good things. You know, reading, meditating in the morning is always a good thing. Before I get reading this myself, I wanna show you guys the quote of the day because this really does like make me feel in a better mood. And it's a good way to start it because they say your day ends in a similar mindset to the way you started. June 26th, the gift of prayer. Prayer is not asking, it is a longing of the soul. It is daily admission of one's weaknesses, or weakness. And so, it is better in prayer to have a heart without words than words without a heart. That's really, yo, Gandhi, dude? That dude is a G, literally. His name starts with G, he's Gandhi. That is so good, that is so good. This is so good. I once saw a blind man rocking endlessly in the sun, an unstoppable smile on his face. Not a word was uttered. To me, he was a priest, a shaman, and his whole being was praying and shouting in silence that the day beyond his blindness was happily enough. You like that perfectly timed train? Center yourself, and as you breathe, close your eyes and seize all asking. Simply breathe with gratitude for the air. Dude, actually, I really, really like that daily meditation. If it's from Gandhi, you know it's gonna be good. In the comments below, guys, let me know. Have you ever meditated before? Have you tried to meditate? Some people might say they, not, they might not have the time to, but everyone does. Meditating is simply sitting in silence. Crap, did Louis sneak through the hole? Lulu. You better not have gone through there, buddy. Yo, know, whenever I take Louie out, my mom's like, Are you watching him? Yeah. <laughs> there he is. Hey, Lou. Do you like it back here? This grass is like dying. It's like not even grass. It's like, hey, <laughs> you love it out here, don't you? Oh my goodness, you're like a little bunny. My cat's treated like a princess, like a, like a king, I should say. King Louie. Louis the Wizard King. Oh, that's a good one. Louis the Wizard King. That's what he is, dude. Lady. Hi, baby. What's up, precious little girl? <laughs> we gotta get this baby cranking. But yeah, I'm gonna bring some weights outside and get a little workout in. I wanna do it in the morning or try to get in a habit or pattern of doing that. What's up, homies? Homets? I just got in from a nice Workout, that's my first time bringing the weights outside and lifting them in the sun. So it's doing like push-ups and sit-ups. You know, it's all about getting that good routine, man. If you form healthy, healthy, good habits, you'll consistently do them and keep improving yourself. And you know, obviously if you do, if you have bad habits, they'll just keep getting worse. And you and I, we have bad habits that we're not even aware of. I know I have habits like Tricking my dumb phone or playing a silly app for too long. It doesn't seem like procrastination when you're doing something, but it is when that something is not helping you or like what you're supposed to do, you know. I'm a victim of uh, procrastination. I'm a victim. I used to procrastinate in high school all the time. Like it was bad. Like I would wait till the last day to do my homework, the last minute. Not a good habit, but I'm um, former new ones. All right, I gotta go get showered and stuff, bro.
right for the day. Well, I need my clothes too. Ooh, whoa, there's so much bacon. <laughs> Even the animals are waiting. You're a professional lady. She's always in a picture pose. Yeah. <laughs> It smells so good. <laughs> we get a plate here. Well, of course, I can't start the day without my lucky pendant on. Duh! My Elite Shop pendant is still available for sale. Although it's not the most practical thing, it's just something cool that I like. That's right, bro. Elite shot luck. Glasses are so easy. I sometimes wear contacts, I sometimes wear my glasses. Just, you know, you can't be just plop. I could see instead of having to poke your eyeball with your finger. This looks tasty. It's a masterpiece, Grandma. Yeah, I thought it tastes like it. That looks delicious. What am I gonna do when I move? How am I gonna make this? <laughs> Look at all that bacon. It definitely tastes like a masterpiece, Grandma. Good. Yo, guys, I want to show you something that I got in the mail, bros. We got some packages. I'm always getting stuff in the mail, homies. So first, let's open this one. And here is something sweet, yo. I haven't seen what it looks like yet, but it's something that every single one of you can use and uses every single day. However, this one's cooler. It's more unique. It's got my Elite Shot touch, baby. Yo, what is that, dude? Oh my god. Yo! Yo! Dude, they weren't joking! That's what I call an Edge Mat Elite Shot mouse pad. A company by the name of Edge Mats hit me up and asked if I wanted my own Elite Shot mouse pad. Of course I said yes, and they asked, what size would you like? I said, the biggest one you got, and they did exactly that. Look at this beast. I'm in love with it, bro! Yo, this is going to set up right now. We gotta make some room. Look at the size difference, holy. And yo, I thought this mat was pretty big. Nope, not as big as this one. Holy crap, homies. That's what I call a big mouse pad. If you guys are interested in getting one, check out the description and see if there's a link that'll take you to the shop where they're available at. Ooh, I do love it. It just makes the desk pop more, more color, bro. This next thing I want to show you is actually uh, something that will allow me to go somewhere to experience something for the first time. You like how broad I make that to make it more mysterious? Let's check this out. Okay, a package in a package. Digital Dreams is an EDM festival. And here's the wristband. And instead of dollars and credit cards, you use your wristband to swipe. So I can put however much money I want on here. Check this out. The festival is in Canada, in Toronto, from July 2nd and the 3rd. This is so dang hype, bro. Because I absolutely love EDM. EDM stands for Electronic Dance Music. It's the kind of vibes I'm always bumping in my videos. I'm always blasting it here in my house, dude. So I'm going to my first ever EDM festival next weekend, and I can't wait, dude. I'm gonna have to make some videos ahead of time, so for when I'm gone, I'll still have content up. And I also expect to bring my GoPro and record some footage of the festival. It's going to be insane. Insane, dude.
I'm just about to get live streaming. I'm all set up, got my Twitch open, OBS, microphones ready to go, social media, music, my Nat Duma, dude. I'm ready to stream. I want to get in the habit of streaming every Sunday. Elite Stream Sunday. So definitely hit me up on Twitch and see what's good and join me live next time, okay? What's up, everybody? Dude, the check is flying, I swear. Everyone say hi. You guys are on YouTube right now. I'm recording me, recording you. Oh, now the chat's gonna really fly. There's no slow-mo either, man. Everyone's getting on here right now. If you guys are missing out on this, definitely follow my Twitch because it's awesome, it's fun. I play news guy chat, I answer questions, we hang out. It's always a good time. Don't miss out, bro. All right, guys, let's get playing here. Woo! Yo. I just got done. I just finished streaming for like three and a half hours, bro. It's been real. After a long stream sesh, it sure wears me out, dude. I'm pretty pooped. I need my car keys. I want to go get a sub or something. Then I want to also uh, check my P.O. box to see if I got any more mail. I'm starving, Marvin. Instead of going to Subway, I think I actually might try a different place. I always go to Subway. The box mobile. I recently got these new wires too. I got an aux cable and another one to charge up, man. The necessities. I actually like going to the store and buying stuff. Who would have guessed? But even like the simple stuff, like deodorant, shampoo, toothpaste, mouthwash, contact solution. I mean, I like actually going out and picking that stuff myself. I guess that's what being a grown up's all about. Ooh, it's toasty in here, dude. It is really toasty. This vehicle's got some nice AC. It cools down real quick. Let's get these tunes bumping, bro. I think I first might make a run. And by running, I mean a drive. To my P.O. box. And then I'll hit up some sub place. Ooh, this track is good. My voice song. I think it's called the Vanna. Look both ways before you cross the street, kids. Alright, so I'm pretty sure they're like still open, even though there's no one working. I think it's still open inside. I hope. Yo, I think we're good, dude. Yo, where's my box at? 172, baby, where you at? Okay, we got a couple. We got a few here. If you guys send me a pre-stamped and self-addressed envelope, meaning you get an envelope, you put a stamp on it, Put your address on it and put that inside of an envelope. You send that to me. I'll then send you a couple of stickers back along with my business card. Thankfully, my bro Pat's been helping me out. We've been sending stickers out. And a lot of you guys should have been getting them. I haven't done it in a while because I was just getting overwhelmed by all of it. But I'm starting to back up. And uh, if you want stickers, follow the simple steps, dude. All right, it's time to get our our munch on dude I'm hungry I was streaming like I said for three and a half hours now I need I need some fuel bro I gotta fuel up all right yo let's get out of here different vibes this is not part of my playlist it's just on like random time to roll out yo dudes Whose home is this? It's mine, baby. See that sold sign? You know why it says that? Cause I bought it, bro. I'll be living here, man. So many things are gonna go down. 
this year. I can't wait, bro. The day I saw this home, I knew it was the one for me and I absolutely love it. I have so many plans, it's crazy. Like so many plans. I've been thinking what I'm gonna do. Got some four wheelers. I've been thinking what I wanna do for each room for the past few months now. And I just wanna get it, move in, dude. Ah, it's gonna happen. And I'll definitely bring you guys with me. Just keep your eyes peeled. All right, let's go get some food. I'm going to devour this barbecue chicken sub. I need the fuel. And Louie, you're not getting any of it. It's for me, Lou. Lou, Lou. I'm going to devour this. I'll give you guys a little taste test. I don't know. First bite. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Food tastes so much better when you're hungry. Mmm. Mm. I don't know if you like barbecue sauce, Lou. Do you like barbecue? Dude, it's so good. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this. All right, dudes, I'm wrapping this vlog up. I hope you enjoyed day in the life of me. You know, it wasn't too crazy, it wasn't too special, but I'm just like you, man. I like recording these because they're fun, they're different, and I enjoy doing them. You guys get to see a peek in the life of me, and I hope you guys want to see more of these. When I get my own place, definitely expect to see more vlogs, dude. I'm gonna be all by myself. And when I take my camera out, I'm talking to you. Like when I'm talking, I'm talking right to you, the person watching this. So thank you for sticking with me and the EE. -E. Anyways, yo, my name's Sean, AKA Elite Shot. I'm your friendly COD fanboy. And when the head's on, the game's on. I'm signing out. Catch y'all real soon. Peace.